In this lecture, we'll be talking about the data flow in Power BI. Suppose you have a raw database which is available anywhere and you want to bring that data into Power BI as a data set. And from this data set, you want to create the dashboard or report in the Power BI. And now, usually when you are having this data set ready, it could be your Excel sheet or any other data set. So from here, you can, of course, directly generate the report. So what Dataflow will do that it will bring the data to the data lake. So your raw data will come into data warehouse and from here it will move to the data set. And then this data set will be linked to your report. So the benefit of this raw data, of course, raw data will consist of uh, many tables. It will consist of a lot of information. So you will transform it when you will move it to the data flow and this will become reusable. It means that from this data flow, you can create multiple data sets and you can keep changing this data set depending upon your needs and requirements. So which means that this data set is linked to this report, but you can have another report which is linked to this data set. So but all the times you will need to refresh the data flow, which will be fetching the data directly from the raw data and from the data flow, you can fetch the data either into your this data set or this data set. To give you an example, suppose you are fetching the raw data from Google Analytics, which is related to your website. So this is your Google Analytics where the data is stored. So raw data is the Google Analytics. And from Google Analytics through the data flow, you are fetching this data and bringing in here. Here you are transforming it, loading it, and based on this data, then you are, you are creating the data set. Usually, we'll be using the Power BI desktop to create the reports here. So, we'll be using Power BI desktop. And in Power BI desktop, we will be linking this particular data flow. And from the data flow, we'll be creating the report here. And then we'll be publishing this to the Power BI service. And then this data flow will be created there. So I'll show you complete step here. You can either use Power BI desktop directly through the data flow to create the reports. And once you have created the reports, if you want to publish this report, you will publish this. And I'll show you how you can directly link this data set with the Power BI data flow to make sure that it automatically updates when the update is required.